day of work, got my bag with my extra warm hoodie and a t-shirt and like a long sleeve in case it's, it's really cold. So I can layer up, go book and let's go to work. Okay, so, hey, hi, hello, hello. It's Rick and very welcome to or back to my channel. Today, as you can probably tell from the title of this video, this is a day in my life. Um, working part-time and doing all my stuff. Um, this is kind of more for me than you because it is my last day at Fritz Wieners, so I thought it would be kind of cool just to like encapsulate a day of like what my life has been like for so long now. Just, you know, progress updates and all that. But yeah, pretty much that was what I do before I go to work. I literally just get up and do that routine every single morning. Breakfast, getting up, putting my work uniform on and then heading out to work. And then I'll tell you a little bit of work and then what I do after work. So let's get into it and I hope you guys enjoy. Uh, yeah. Okay, so I obviously just got in and I just have to open up. I can't really film this, so we'll be back when it's open. Okay, all set up. I've sold a few. I realize my mask literally has to be lopsided so that my glasses don't get fogged up. So everyone must think I look stupid. But anyways, yeah, all set up. Matt's gonna come visit. That'll be the next update. Otherwise, I'm gonna sit and read and wait for customers. How's it going? It's so quiet. Outside of perspective, you like walk out and have a little buggy. I make a hot dog. Then I serve the hot dog. And that's it. <laughs> But it's all over. I've been doing this for eight months. Six months. Five, yeah. Six to eight months because of COVID. So, like, three. I've been doing it for ages. But it's time to move on. Bye for two. I don't really have any ideas today. Following the lightnings on your cheeks. Because, baby, your absence life is boring so i never the cutest of the cutest pants and the cutest blazer with matching shoes and i want to be her like when i'm over i'm gonna be her like how would you like onions and sour cream i'll have onions please that's what a service voice be like do you not want sour cream no what about loads of sour cream no thanks okay. these onions are so good today spicy Ah, uh, yes, please. What sauces would you like? Ah, uh, can I please have a tomato? Yep. Okay. Awesome. Anything else? No, that's all, thanks. That's all? Yeah. Oh, that's the fun part. Sorry. Oh, I'll put barbecue sauce on there. Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's barbecue. <laughs> One of my regulars just came up to me. I didn't know his name. Like he comes up like once a month, two times a month. And he was like, uh, we're just like talking about what's happening. He's like, how's your day going? I was like, that's pretty good. It's like my last shift. And he was like, oh no, like you're so positive. Like you drag everyone in because you're so positive. Make sure you keep that positive spirit wherever you go. He said he yarned about people being positive and meeting other cool people in the world. And then he was like, small world, might run into you another day. My name's Gaz, what's your name? I was like, oh my God. This makes me feel like I'm appreciated cooking hot dogs. <laughs> okay, so I've got one. There's only one more to sell now. Um, I get to have a free one. And I now love the spicy ones. And then my favorite like combo is onions, no sauerkraut, honey mustard, and tomato sauce. And it's so good. And I don't usually like spicy stuff, but I can get through a whole one. So that's good. We have one spicy left today. It's probably literally gonna to be too hot to eat now, but I wanna eat it so bad. And then I always burn my mouth on it and I can just feel how warm it is. So I'm not even gonna risk it. Oh my God, that guy's outfit is so good. He's wearing like a plaid suit and a bow tie and he looks so fire. Oh my God, he looks so cute. He's got a Louis Vuitton bag. Ooh, two Louis Vuitton bags. This man's a cool though. Oh, and he's got pink socks on. Wait, I wish I could like, take a photo of him but I can't but he looks really cool he's got a really good haircut and then his friend oh he didn't even know it was his friend but his friend's wearing like a really cool trench coat but I feel like maybe he has a cool outfit on underneath I don't know okay I want someone to come order it because then I can close this up and I can just sit here 
and eat my last one. I thought, in peace. Just mm -mm -mm. kiss. Also, that guy from before, and I put the little memo in about, he said that um other people have talked about how smiley I am here and how it makes them want to come down. I was like, oh, Love good customer service, am I right? Especially when it comes from yourself. That was really good. I still have one to sell though, so I think I'm just gonna close because it's obviously not selling. Or I'll just do the other stuff that I can do before I have to fully give up on it. I just realized there's so many pigeons up there that I've never seen before. I wonder if they sit there every day or if it's just today. Getting all sentimental. But you know, it's part of the success story. I worked at a hot dog stop and I can't give up an opportunity like what I have with Native and Jenny, so. That'll be good. A couple people I've talked to about it today, like my regulars. I'm like, that's such an awesome opportunity. Like, congratulations. Like, good luck at your next job. I'm like, yeah, thank you. It's been lovely knowing you. It's been lovely serving you hot dogs. And now I'm getting close. I don't know how much of this I can film either, so I'll just film maybe a little bit. Maybe there'll be a little montage now. Let's go. I have been so incredibly stitched up. I just finished closing and now it's pouring down with rain. And I have to pull down this like flap and there's like rain poured in it. And one time I did it and it literally went all over my face. Um, but I couldn't have been more stitched up. Like I just finished and this happened. But I don't think it's gonna stop either. So I think I literally just have to like brace it and get home. But my hair looked so good. But anyways, I closed up, didn't do a little montage for you guys because I just had to close up. And just had my little boogie have my music on have like a dance or I'll listen to a podcast and it's like clean whilst listening to the podcast um but now it's time to go home and brace the rain yippee no. I just got home sitting here talking to Ollie um and then there's an earthquake and I was like well I'm in the right place aren't I I'm in the doorway wait is that what you meant to be Okay, good. <laughs> also, top tip, you're actually not meant to be in a doorway. That was incorrect. We're actually learning what to do now so that we're safe next time. So you're meant to be under a strong table away from windows, tall furniture. Okay, I've been talking to Ollie for a while and then messaging my friend Amy and now I'm having a shower. So just like realistic of vlog of like what happens when I come home from work is yeah, chill out for a little bit. And then today, because I don't have work tomorrow, I'm going to get the hot dog smell off of me because I never have to smell like hot, dog, hot dogs again, which is a positive. Ignore the fact that this is so dirty. Um, yeah, it's a long story, but it, it's not my job to clean it. It's Matthew's. So anyways, time for a shower. Goodbye, work uniform. Okay, we'll shower and clean. And I look... A mess i'm actually so drained so i'm highly thinking 24 minute power nap and then i can get up and hustle i'm just like mentally and physically drained at the moment i think the mentally drained is making me physically drained i don't know i just i'm not feeling fabu what was wrong with me why did i say that but i'm gonna have a nap and then i'm gonna get up and hustle I've literally forgotten to update this whole time, but I had my nap, I had dinner, and now I'm packing in, packaging up some Depop orders and trade me orders, um, because I'm feeling a little deflated tonight. Like, that's not like a usual thing, but just not feeling really that great, and I'm already committed to the vlog, and I can't read really the vlog, because it was my last day. Um, so this will probably be like almost it. I actually might just sign it off here. There's really not that much more interesting content looking a little bit homeless and I kind of just want to focus on getting a few productive things done um before I like call it a night and cark it um so yeah hope you guys enjoyed and I will be back next week for a another video bye Darling, my heart, my love.